Hello ladies, I am standing on my back porch and the reason why I'm standing on my back porch is because it is raining here in Michigan and I received a request about uh, roughly maybe two weeks ago and a young lady and her husband is doing a gym area located inside of their garage and they are going to use part of their garage for a gym area and the other part they're going to be able to park their car but anywho she wanted to know if I could give a a complete tour of my garage uh, gym area that's located inside of my garage because we only use half of our garage um, for my gym area that my husband created for me and the other half has garage stuff on side of it okay so you got to keep in mind ladies this is not a commercial gym this is not a professional gym. This is my garage. And this is what my garage looks like from standing on my back porch. So I already have the door open um, to the garage. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to walk over to the garage door. And I'm going to back up a little bit so I can give you a view, uh, my dear, of what my garage looks like from in my backyard so I'm just gonna step down and I'm gonna just walk towards uh, my garage this is the the garage I'm gonna back up and this is what the garage looks like the garage door rather this is what she looks like oh I'm, I'm trying not to fall because the ground is wet but this is what the garage looks like the garage door rather and I just came from over there and we're standing kind of like in the backyard and we're looking at the garage door and at the garage door we have a screen there you got a barbecue pit there and you got the trash cans down here but this is what the garage um, door looks like and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna walk over towards the garage door and I'm gonna open the screen up because I already have the door already open so what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk over to this screen this is what the screen looks like up on her and I'm gonna open her up and I'm just gonna step inside of the garage so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to do a quick pan around of my garage area this is what my garage looks like and this is what my gym area looks like inside of my garage so I'm going to just do a quick pan around of the area that my gym area is located in, which is this area right here. This is what it looks like. This is the garage. This is my gym area that's located inside of my garage area. So what we're looking at, we're looking at the little water cooler thing that we made for our grandbabies. So we have my deep freezer in here. We have my punching bag, we have my refrigerator. That clock is what I had my husband to add for me and he also got me a, another refrigerator because the little refrigerator over there wasn't holding enough water. So I wanted a new refrigerator and he got that one for me, which I did have one already here, but that was old. And I wanted a, mm, a better one, put it that way. And I had my husband to get me that one. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna walk over here to this refrigerator. Because we're going to start over here. And I'm going to just turn around without running into anything. And I'm going to give you ladies, and my dear, a view of what my gym area looks like from over here. There's the doorway where I came in at. There's the door. There's the screen. And this is what my gym area looks like from here. I'm just going to pan around. Pan around from this side over here. This is what she looks like from over here. And what we're gonna do is, we're gonna start right here at this table. Uh, right next to the table is my refrigerator I'm no longer using. I have my fan there. Um, we put up black sheets to hide the garage stuff on this side. Uh, we purchased two chairs to match the table because I wanted matching chairs. Uh, these baskets came from the Dollar Tree and I house towels in one and I have my uh, exercising books in one and the magazines are on the way that goes in this basket 
Then we have the Lysol hand sanitizer. We have uh, the sign that we created for the gym. We have one of my exercising book, and we have the remote control to the television that I had my husband to put up for me. And this is what she looks like from, I'm gonna try to walk over here so I can show it to you. This is my television that I had my husband to uh, put up for me. This is what I was waiting on. I was waiting for him to put my television up. And this is what she looks like. There's a door, there's a shelf that has uh, garage stuff on it that I covered up because I wanna look at it. But anywho, this is where my television is located at. And there's the screen and there's the door. And I'm gonna back back up because we're gonna start back over here. So I have my exercising bike here. I have my exercising ball there. I have my Nota track there. I have my other balls over here. I'm gonna go around the Nota track. We have the elliptical here. These mats that you see, these exercising mats, they were purchased from Amazon. Behind my elliptical, which is right here, I have my waist training disc there. Um, I have my fan, my heater, uh, 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 exercising thing to use for your arms. Uh, I can't, these look like um, surfboard looking things my husband uses. Uh, then we have my treadmill here. This is what she looks like. Then we have a ladder up there. And then I DIY'd this little basket. These uh, racks came from Walmart. They're the same racks that I use in my closet. You're supposed to use them in your kitchen cabinets for plates and bowls and things like that. But I use them, use, use them in here to house. Uh, first of all, I went to the Dollar Tree, bought these baskets. I rip -tied, zip tied them to the rack. And this holds the boxing gloves. This is a garbage can that came from the Dollar Tree. I rip -tied, zip tied it to um, the rack as well. It holds my yoga mats. I have uh, a cycling, cycling bike down there. My disc is located there. Um, on this uh, rack here, I have my medicine ball, my training balls. These little things here is weights for your wrists and your ankles. Those are uh, little things you use to strengthen your hands. I have my push-up bars. I have my yogurt uh, balls down here. In this basket, laundry basket that I zip-tied also to the rack has my app with some of my yogurt stuff that's located in here and then I'm gonna back up because you have the cycling bike right here and then you have my my weights over there that's on there and then you have my bands over here uh, I don't know if you can see them I have my bands and stuff that's located here I have a, a bodybuilding lady ladies up here I have a mirror I have my dumbbell workout chart. Um, I have uh, this gym rule thing that we DIY. Up here is uh, some pictures that we put up here on top of the garage. I'll show you what they look like in a minute. We have my my stepper, my step platform. Uh, these mats here came from um, Five Below, and I actually use these mats. This little square area here is when I'm doing my workout. This is my workout routine that I work out to. And I use this little section right here for that area. And then we purchased this, um, this, this metal rack from Walmart to hold the weights. And then up above the weights, we have the gloves that you use to lift the weights with. Um, I'll show you what I'm talking about. And then we have weights here. I don't have many weights, but I have some weights. And I have one, two, three, four, five pounds. And then five pounds, 10 pounds, 10 pounds, 20, 25, 20, 16, 10, five. And then I house my jump ropes here and my scale here. And then I'm gonna just back up and show you the weight bar is down there. That's what the gloves are for. And you have the weight bench here, you have a weight bench there, and you have a trash can here. You have the gym is from the Hobby Lobby. I spray painted it white and we put that up there. We made the Burwell Gym sign there. We put that rack up to house your tiles. We have a mirror. 
up above there I have some pictures I'm gonna go a little closer so you can see what what I'm talking about they're just ladies and men's bodybuilders and that's what it looks like and then here I have just some weights and kettlebells on display I try to keep everything off the floor um, in the garage I don't want anything on the floor so I try to keep everything off the floor so that's why that's on display there the same weights that I have here on display I have the same weights over there but this is what my um, gym area over here we have weight vests that's located here and then we have a hand sanitizer here we have a whiteboard there and this is what my gym area that's located inside of my garage looks like. She's not anything to write home about, you know. Um, I'm just thankful that I have a place to um, work out in. I'm, I'm grateful for that. And I'm going to go over here because I want to show you the little clock that my husband put up for me. There's a clock. And he put the tracking lights up for me. And what we did was we spray painted the walls in the garage these walls back here is actually white but they look silver because my color scheme is um, silver and black and then we spray painted the wall back there black and there's a black sheet we spray painted that wall black uh, we put a black cloth around uh, that area because that's some everything that I try to cover up with uh, a cloth or, you know um, fabric or anything like that it's got something to do with the gym got something to do with the garage area and I did not want the garage area to be shown in my gym so I tried to cover up as much as possible in the gym area so you don't see too much of the garage stuff but this is a garage so got to keep that in mind but this is what my gym area looks like that's located inside of my garage um, I hope uh, this is good enough for you uh, over there on that shelf, I do house my radio, my speaker, my cordless phone, and the doorbell is located over there. And I do have my refrigerator here and the deep freezer. So I hope this was good enough for you. Um, if it was not, just a inbox me again, and I would try to do uh, a, a little bit better than what I'm doing now. But I'm going to get ready to end this video and go inside the inside of the house because it's raining out here. And you ladies have a blessed and wonderful day. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.